Hello, old friends. Swaylex in the house, not me. I mean, he's in the house on the video. Uh, man, I have not done a Swaylex collab in so long. And by the way, Swaylex is a very good dude. I cannot go into how good a dude he is. He's a, a, just a tremendously good human being. But anyways, I'm excited to see this cover. I see Sway's changed up the camera angle. It's been a long time, so maybe it's been changed for a while. I'm excited. Oh, he's got the same focus right I got, the red, the red scarlet box. All right, let's go. Let's do it. Oh, I also know, hey, Sway, if you're here, I see your lamp also is crooked in the middle. I can never get that shit to fix. I got like five of those lamps. They're always just all crooked as hell, man. That's nothing to do with nothing. Oh, hell yeah. absolute fire it's so uh, it's already i'm loving it just loving the whole thing and sway i didn't know you was ripped son damn all right some of us need to go work out The toms sound great on top of this. I, I don't want to speak out of hand because I don't remember, but this might be my favorite combination of sounds so far. Also, I mean, okay, obviously a leap is a badass, right? If you want to hear me talk about how amazing the leap is, just go watch the reaction of me watching his video. But right now I'm loving the combination of the drums and the amazing, which I mean, they're, it's MIDI, so I guess he's just setting the pitch in the interface. But how great the tom sound going to the bass drum. It's like a nice descending melodic line, a scale probably, going from the three toms to the bass drum. Sounds really, really good. Oh, also, a leaf's playing is complicated, not complicated, but it's what well, it is complicated, but he's uh, taking up a lot of rhythmic space. And so it makes sense that Sway is actually playing less complicated on top of that because it's he's not cluttering the music. That's the fastest subdivision he's doing. Right? His touch is sway. Your touch is so light on the hi hat. I feel like he's doing six teats, but accenting the and. But it could just be one and. But I feel like his touch is just so good that there's two 16th notes that are just kind of disappearing, like, lightly in the background.
Oh, and just for a second, he, he added a bump, 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 bump on the bass drum. And these other these other little things that I don't know, you know, I don't know who's here, who's noticing what. But earlier, uh, Sway was going boom, 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 which is like just it's adding. It's not too much. It's just adding a little emphasis. Boom, 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 boom. Okay, you know what it is? They they must be in the same key. The drums must actually be in the same key as the song. And so that little the the work on the toms almost seems like a um counter melody on the toms. It's definitely a counter rhythm, but it's like an extra <laughs> Go ahead. Go ahead, get you some. <laughs> He's having such a good time. Well, hold on. I, dude, I 100% love it. Um, sway if you were here, man, or anyone who's listening. Uh, I'm having one of those ideas that's going to cost people money. The sound of those toms is so good that I'm almost like, I wish he had three more toms or five more toms, like, you know, little toms all tuned in the scale. So you could do even more stuff in the scale because that all sounded like so radically good. And if I dare be so cocky and so arrogant, when you was going off at the end and playing just your own drum thing, it would have been kind of cool to me anyways to quote some of that Tom shit like once or twice. To like do the exact same Tom work you did in the middle of the jam. To kind of just like link it all together. But whatever, that shit was fire. Shit was fire. Man, I fucking love good drummers, dude. <sighs> oh me, oh my, oh me, oh my. I guess this is over. Trimakasi, Don Laganon. I'm out.